Welcome to Concept Learn. Hello everyone, myself Yashaswini. Welcome to Concept Learn. So today in this session, I will be dealing about the various birds that are attacking and destroying the field plants also. So let's see regarding them one by one. These birds, they belongs to that of the class is like the insects will be belonging to that of the class insecta. Here these birds belongs to the class aves and these birds are found to have a very unique character that is their forelimbs are here modified as the wings. So if you see here these wings are the modified form of forelimbs and further if you see its mouth also its mouth is further continued to form the structure known as beak. So here these mouth is further continue form the structure which is called as the beak here. If you see in case of the insects, insects are generally ectothermal in origin. That means in order to maintain their own body temperature, they will be depending upon the surrounding environment. Whereas these birds here, these are homeothermous. That means maintain their own body temperature without depending means they will not depend upon the surrounding environments in order to maintain their temperature. So, they will be having their own body temperature here and these are birds are granivorous because they will be further feeding upon the grains and surviving and nearly due to these birds the damage by these birds is done to food grains even in the fields and also in the stores which is affecting both it in terms of its quantity and quality. That means in terms of quantity consuming more amount of the grains and is resulting in the quantitative losses and qualitatively this is also spoiling the storage places or even in the feed by means of its uh, excreta and its feather it is also causing the qualitative and the quantitative losses here. First one is that of the common pigeon. So its scientific name is Columba livia. And these common pigeons are generally granivorous. That means they will be consuming the food grains here. Okay. Generally attacking the places like go-downs and the grain mandis in order to consume the grains. Day to day life also you will be seeing many number of these uh, common pigeons which will be consuming these grains here. And next is that of the house sparrow. And its scientific name here is Passer domesticus. And this house sparrow is principally a granivorous. That means here this also feeds upon the food grains. Generally, these house sparrow within the olden days uh, where they were constructing the homes with that of the wood houses. So within that they will be constructing its nest and these house sparrows were most commonly seen over there. So here these leaves and enters in the house and it will be living along with that of the people. And also in the warehouses also it will be attacking and eats the grains in open or also in bag storages.